dysmenorrhea or menstrual cramps is the throbbing in the lower abdomen. It is felt by women either before or during their menstruation. Menstrual cramps can be lessened with the proper lifestyle choices, such as eating and exercising, unless there is an underlying condition that needs to be treated. Here is the natural solutions to cut the cramps. Hydrate, drink more water. Menstrual cramps or primary dysmenorrhea are an uncomfortable part of life for many women on a monthly basis. Drink more water may help is bloating, which makes symptoms worse. Get in the habit of drinking 6 to 8 glasses of water per day, especially during your period. Add some mint or lemon wedge to make it more palatable. While you are at it, back off the salt, which encourages fluid retentions and bloating. Avoid alcohol, which promotes dehydration. Some women experience diarrhea or vomiting in conjunction with menstrual cramps. It's important to replace lost fluids by drinking plenty of water. It reduces pain. Diet is key. You may be craving fatty, sugary, or salty foods when you have your period. But these foods are not your friends. Skip the donuts and potato chips. Some women find that eating the right kinds of foods may help ease menstrual pain. Anti-inflammatory foods like cherries, blueberries, squash, tomatoes, and bell pepper are good choices. Cold water fish that is high in omega-3 fatty acids are also healthy choices. Eat more calcium rich beans, almonds, and dark leafy greens. These foods contain compounds that combat inflammation. Some women report that eating this way can help ease menstrual pain and boost health. It's best to eat healthy, balanced diet year-round, not just for a few days a month during your period. Chamomile tea. Sipping chamomile tea may help reduce cramps when you menstruate. Chamomile tea is a full of anti-inflammatory substances that inhibit prostaglandins. Prostaglandins are made by cells in the endometrium of the uterus. These cells release prostaglandins during a woman's period, provoking muscle contractions of the uterus, pain, and cramps. Prostaglandins in the bloodstreams are responsible for nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, and headache during the menstrual period. NSAIDs like naproxen and ibuprofen reduce prostaglandin production. Sipping chamomile tea inhibits pain-causing prostaglandins and enhances menstrual flow to ease period symptoms. Cinnamon A sprinkle of cinnamon In a study of young women, those who took capsules containing 420 mg of cinnamon three times a day for the very first three days of their menstrual cycle had less menstrual bleeding, less pain, and reduction in nausea and frequency of vomiting compared to those who took a placebo. The woman did not report any side effects associated with taking cinnamon pills. Try a sprinkle of cinnamon on your cereal or cup of hot cocoa. It cannot hurt and it might help your cramps and other period symptoms. Ginger Go for ginger. A study of young women found that ginger capsule relieved symptoms. 
of primary dysmenorrhea, including painful periods as well as NSAIDs like ibuprofen and methanamic acid. Women in the ginger group took 250 milligrams capsules of ginger four times a day for the first three days of their periods. Women in the methanomic acid group took 250 milligrams capsules four times per day, while those in the ibuprofen group took 400 milligrams per day four times per day. Women in each of the three treatment groups reported similar pain relief, satisfaction with treatment, and reduction in severity of dysmenorrhea. Regardless of which treatment they took, none of the women in the study reported severe side effects with any treatment. Try a little ginger if you'd like a drug-free alternative for period pain relief. Curcumin. Curcumin, an ingredient in the root turmeric, may help relieve PMS symptoms. Women who took two capsules of curcumin per day for seven days prior to menstruation and for three days after their period began experienced a reduction in PMS symptoms. Compared to women who took placebo pills, Scientists think beneficial compounds in curcumin combat inflammations and alter neurotransmitter levels, all of which may be responsible for the reduction in PMS symptoms. Women treated with curcumin reported improvements in behavioral mood and physical symptoms due to PMS. Curcumin may also have benefits for people with inflammatory conditions like arthritis, IBS, inflammatory bowel disease, autoimmune disease, and other conditions. Vitamin D, the sunshine of vitamin D. Crumbs associated with dysmenorrhea can be disabling. Painful cramps associated with dysmenorrhea occur due to increasing levels of prostaglandins, which cause the uterus to contract. These contractions cause the shedding of the uterine lining. Vitamin D reduces the production of prostaglandins. In one study of young women who had primary dysmenorrhea, and low vitamin D levels, high weekly doses of supplemental vitamin D decrease pain intensity significantly both 8 weeks into treatment and 1 month after the end of treatment. The woman taking vitamin D also took less pain medication to treat period pain. You can ask your doctor to measure your vitamin D levels with a sample blood test. Magnesium. Magnesium is an essential mineral your body needs to fuel more than 300 enzyme systems. You need it to build muscles, proteins, and healthy bones. Your body needs magnesium for the proper functions of muscles and nerves to regulate blood pressures and control blood sugar levels. You need magnesium to build DNA and RNA and to manufacture glutathione, the master antioxidant of the body. Magnesium may also help alleviate symptoms of PMS, especially when taking with vitamin B6. One study of women found that who took 250 mg of magnesium and 40 mg of vitamin B6 per day experienced the greatest reductions in PMS symptoms. Be careful! Magnesiums interfere with the act 
effectivity of certain medications, including antibiotics, proton, proton pump inhibitors or PPIS, diuretics, and uh, bisphosphonates as your doctor or pharmacist if magnesium is appropriate and safe for you. Skip the caffeine. Eliminating caffeine helps many women relieve menstrual pain. Caffeine comes in many forms including coffee, tea, soda, chocolate, and energy drinks. If you consume caffeine daily, you may need to taper your dose down slowly to avoid withdrawal symptoms. As a substitute, try smoothies loaded with antioxidants, rich greens, berries, and protein powder. The nutrients will give you a much-needed pick-me-up with the increased pain that accompany caffeine. Heating pad. Applying a heating pad, heat the rub or hot water bottle to your abdomen works wonders for relieving menstrual cramps. You can find these items in the drugstore or online. The continuous applications of heat may work as well as ibuprofen for the relief of dysmenorrhea pain. Heat helps muscles relax. One study of women between the ages of 18 and 30 who had primary dysmenorrhea found that those who applied a heat patch that heated to 104 degrees Fahrenheit experienced similar pain relief benefits from the patch as those who relied on ibuprofen for cramps. If you don't have heating pad, heat wrap, hot water bottle, or heat patch handy, a hot shower or warm towel can be used instead. Exercise. Get moving to relieve symptoms. Many women find that exercising helps relieve menstrual cramps. Exercise release endorphins, brain chemicals that promote well-being, whether you enjoy walking, running, or swimming. It's safe to participate in all of these activities during your menstrual period. Yoga and Tai Chi are gentler forms of exercise that may be easier to do if you experience fatigue. Massage. Massaging your abdomen for as little as 5 minutes a day may be able to help relieve menstrual cramps. Massage encourage blood flow. Massing cream containing essential oils like clary sage, lavender, and marjoram has additional benefits for the body. These oils contain compounds that have been reported by many to help relieve pain and soothe dysmenorrhea. Acupuncture and acupressure are Eastern healing treatments that stimulate certain trigger points on the skin to produce desired effects in the body. The therapies are very effective for a variety of medical conditions, including menstrual cramps. An acupuncturist can use needles to decrease a woman's menstrual cramps. The practitioner can show you where these trigger points are and how to stimulate them with pressure. From your hands to achieve similar results, applying to key points on the back, abdomen, feet, and the fleshy part between your thumb and index finger can be effective treatments for pain. The best part is, since these techniques are drug-free, you can do them anytime you experience symptoms. Ask the practitioner for articles with pictures that can help you learn how to do acropecture on yourself. Bath Sooth Pain 
A warm bath may be just the thing you need to soothe pain and relax. Tense muscles start by adding some luxurious bubble bath or fragrant essential oil. Read your favorite book or magazine to help melt stress and tension away. Taking a bath in the evening is a great activity to help you wind down and sleep better. If you're not a bath person, a warm shower can produce similar benefits and reduce pelvic pain and other symptoms.